The photography world is abuzz with anticipation as Hasselblad prepares to launch its next major medium format camera, the Hasselblad X3D 150C. Excitement surrounding this camera is more than mere rumor. Multiple credible sources from China have confirmed its development and hard evidence supports the ongoing speculation. In December 2024, Hasselblad registered a new camera under the code HB722 with the FCC, marking the start of the standard 180-day confidentiality period. This timeline points toward a potential announcement around mid-2025, leaving photographers, videographers and industry insiders eagerly awaiting more details about what this next-generation medium-format camera will bring to the table. At the heart of the Hasselblad X3D150C lies its most anticipated feature, the sensor. Leaks suggest that this camera may sport either a 150 megapixel or an astonishing 250 megapixel medium format sensor, likely sourced from Sony. Such a sensor would not represent a small incremental improvement, but a seismic leap in medium format photography. If these rumors are accurate, the X3D150C could become one of the highest resolution digital cameras ever produced. Beyond the raw resolution, a sensor of this caliber introduces a range of practical challenges that Hasselblad must address to make the camera usable for professionals. One of the most pressing concerns with ultra-high resolution sensors is data processing. Handling the sheer volume of information produced by a 150MP or 250MP sensor requires significant computational power. Industry insiders speculate that Hasselblad may need to introduce a completely new image processing engine to ensure smooth and reliable performance. Current processing platforms, while highly capable, may struggle with files of this magnitude, making efficiency and speed key areas of innovation. Alongside processing power, storage considerations will also become critical. Ultra-high resolution files can be enormous, and the X3D150C will likely demand high-speed, high-capacity memory solutions. Support for next-generation SD Express cards, large internal buffers, and advanced image compression technology may all be necessary to facilitate real-world workflows, ensuring photographers can manage, transfer, and edit these massive files without significant bottlenecks. The potential for unmatched image quality is, of course, a major selling point. For photographers specializing in landscapes, fine art, or commercial work, the level of detail and cropping flexibility offered by a 150MP or 250MP sensor could be revolutionary. However, not all photographers will require this level of resolution. Managing such large files could be cumbersome for users without the necessary storage infrastructure or computing power. Nevertheless, if Hasselblad combines this resolution with its renowned color science and image quality, the X3D150C could set a new standard for medium format cameras. The legacy of cameras like the X2D100C provides a strong foundation, suggesting that Hasselblad will focus not merely on pixel count, but on dynamic range, tonal accuracy, and overall image fidelity. Heat management and power efficiency are additional technical challenges that Hasselblad must address. Pushing hundreds of megapixels through a processor generates substantial heat, which could compromise performance if not properly managed. A high-resolution sensor like the rumored 250MP option will further increase the thermal load, requiring careful engineering to prevent overheating during long shooting sessions. This likely means new cooling mechanisms, whether active or passive, integrated into the X3D150C. Battery life is another crucial consideration, as medium format cameras already consume significant power, and the jump in resolution only compounds the issue. Hasselblad will need to balance performance with battery longevity, ensuring that photographers can rely on the camera for extended shoots without interruption. In terms of design, the X3D150C is expected to maintain Hasselblad's iconic Scandinavian aesthetic, emphasizing minimalism, clean lines, and solid build quality. The camera is likely to feature a magnesium alloy body that balances elegance with durability. Yet, accommodating the advanced internals required for high-resolution processing, cooling, and power delivery may necessitate subtle changes to the camera's form factor. Ergonomics will remain a priority, 
with the potential for a larger grip or refined button layout to ensure comfort during prolonged shoots. Hasselblad has a history of excellent user-focused design, and photographers will expect the X3D 150C to continue this tradition, even if the body grows slightly to accommodate the new hardware. Autofocus has historically been a weak point for medium format cameras, often lagging behind smaller sensor competitors in speed and tracking capabilities. While the X2D 100C improved significantly, fast-paced photography will remains a challenge in this segment. To compete with rivals like the Fujifilm GFX 102, the X3D 150C will need to offer substantially improved autofocus performance. This could include faster subject tracking, enhanced eye and face detection, and better low-light operation. The demands of today's hybrid photographers, who require both stills and video performance, mean that autofocus speed and reliability can no longer be secondary considerations. If Hasselblad succeeds in delivering an autofocus system capable of keeping pace with high-resolution imaging, it will dramatically expand the camera's appeal to professionals who previously accepted slower focus as a trade-off. Video capabilities in medium format cameras have historically lagged behind, but this is changing as more professionals seek hybrid solutions. Hasselblad may equip the X3D 150C with robust video functionality, potentially including 4K or even 8K recording. Achieving this requires more than just a high-resolution sensor. It demands internal 10-bit recording, high-quality codecs, advanced log profiles, and efficient heat dissipation to sustain high bit rates during extended recording sessions. If Hasselblad can integrate these features without compromising ergonomics or battery life, the X3D 150C could attract a new segment of creators seeking cinematic depth and character in their work, offering the versatility needed for modern hybrid workflows. Pricing is an unavoidable discussion when considering a high-end medium format camera. Hasselblad has long been associated with premium pricing and a camera featuring a rumored 250 MP sensor and cutting-edge features will likely place the X3D 150CA among the most expensive medium format cameras ever produced. Competitors such as Fujifilm have made the market more accessible with their GFX series so Hasselblad faces the challenge of balancing innovation with value. The camera's price will need to justify its advanced specifications while remaining competitive enough to attract a broad professional audience. For users, investing in the X3D 150C could be seen as a long-term commitment to creative excellence, especially if it delivers on its promises of high resolution, hybrid video capabilities and refined ergonomics. The Hasselblad X3D 150C also raises important considerations for workflow and practical usage. High-resolution imaging requires not only robust processing and storage, but also efficient file handling, software compatibility, and seamless integration with post-production pipelines. Professionals will want to know whether Hasselblad has optimized the camera for real-world efficiency, minimizing bottlenecks in transferring, editing, and archiving large files. Additionally, the camera's ability to integrate with existing Hasselblad lenses and potential third-party glass will influence its adoption among photographers who already invest heavily in optics. Lens quality, sharpness, and color fidelity will be critical in ensuring that the X3D 150C lives up to its sensor's potential. In conclusion, the Hasselblad X3D 150C represents a significant leap forward in medium format photography. Its rumored 150MP or 250MP sensor, coupled with advancements in autofocus, video capabilities, ergonomics, and heat management, could redefine professional expectations for medium format cameras. While the price will be high and the system complex, early indications suggest that Hasselblad aims to deliver a tool capable of exceeding traditional limitations. If the X3D 150C successfully balances resolution, speed, usability, and hybrid functionality, it may set a new benchmark in professional digital imaging, appealing to photographers, videographers, and hybrid creators seeking the ultimate in image quality and versatility. In conclusion, the Hasselblad X3D 150C embodies a fusion of technical innovation, creative flexibility, and heritage design. From its ultra-high resolution sensor options to potential hybrid video capabilities, the camera is positioned to address the evolving needs of photographers and content creators. 
If Hasselblad successfully executes this vision, the X3D 150C could establish itself as one of the most influential medium format cameras of its generation, setting new standards for image quality, versatility, and professional usability while shaping the future trajectory of high-end photography and hybrid imaging workflows.